less than 30 seconds away from the first stage entry burn. Landing of the first stage, scheduled in about 1 minute 45 seconds. And we have the entry burn entry underway. Burn. And the entry burn has entry ended. Shut down. Stage two still on nominal trajectory. Stage two still on course for its rendezvous with the International Space Station. Stage two engine Stage cutoff one, about two and a half day. minutes away from now. Stage one about to come back subsonic. About 45 seconds away from landing. Transonic. Stage one is transonic. Landing burn about to begin. S1 landing burn. Landing legs will be deployed in about 15 seconds. And a sonic boom felt throughout the Kennedy Space Center in Cape Canaveral Air Force Station area as Falcon 9 first stage landing legs deploy returns to Cape Canaveral Air Force Station landing zone one. LZ-1, the Falcon has landed. Landing operators move into procedure 11.100, section three on LZ-1 net. On the right-hand screen, uh, you're seeing a camera shot from our pad at LZ-1. And the entry burn has just started. So that Falcon 9 is currently thrusting its way uh, just to slow itself down. Entry burn lasts about a minute. Excuse me, about 10 seconds. <laughs> and entry burn has just completed. That was successful. For those of us just joining, on the left-hand side, we have a camera on the first stage as it descends, and on the right-hand side, we have a camera on the ground tracking that first stage as it makes its way back. You can see the rocket start to vibrate around as it hits the thicker parts of the atmosphere. In about 10 seconds, that center Merlin engine is going to ignite once more and set the rocket down as gently as possible at the pad at LZ-1. Landing burn has begun. On the left-hand side, you can see the uh, first stage approaching the pad. And on the right-hand side, you see the pad shot. Let's watch it land.